The IRS has processed more than 79 million tax refunds so far this year. The average refund is $2,900. That's a very tempting target for con artists. Yeah. Local 12's Perry Shively is here with what you need to do to protect yourself. Perry? Yeah, Sheila, it certainly is. Since 2013, con artists have stolen $64 million in refund, refunds from nearly 13,000 people. That's big business for these thieves. So it's more important than ever to protect yourself. It can be tough when criminals are working on a new scam. What they're doing now is they get their hands on returns from previous years. Then they use that information to file new fraudulent returns on unsuspecting expecting victims. After the refund goes into the victim's bank account, the crooks then follow up with a phone call claiming that they're from the IRS and the refund was an error. They then direct them to a fraudulent website to return that money. Now, if this happens to you and even if you don't fall for it, your tax return could be delayed for months. So it's very, very important that tax preparers are, you know that they are reputable because they are the ones being hacked. So again, to avoid this scam, go to a reputable accountant or company to get your taxes done. And if you get a questionable phone call, call police to report it. Sheila, back to you. All right.